Hello there, my Captain Play guys and gals. This is Captain Play Guy here with the next episode of the Captain Play Scribble Knots Unlimited. I think next we'll go to the Lost Kingdom of Parentheses. Parentheses? Thesis. Hmm. Hmm. It, the Ark of the Covenant must be around here. Bring it to me! That would most likely be it, sir. Break the curse by returning the stones to their pillars. Just gonna leave that Basilosaurus behind. I can't swim! Help me get to the surface! You probably need a balloon. My submarine is too large to explore any further. So we're just gonna have to shrink you. We must go deeper! Tiki mask, good sized sinking pineapple, and a rock! Cthulhu slept in! Wake him from his slumber! Mathulu, hail! He's too big. Alright, fine. I'll give you an alarm. Mathulu, help! Oh. Thank you, Poseidus? Poseidon? Zeus? Who? Give me something to help rule the sea. What about a pitchfork? That works. Poseidon's new groove. Give me something to convince Poseidon that I lived a good life. What about a medal? Okay. Oh! Mathulu, I need your help. Yeah, Mathulu, kick his butt. Hey, not my butt. Oh, for a second I thought we bugged out there, but looks like we're good. Okay, that's one. Mathulu, I know we have I know we haven't spoken in a while, but that's just that's just exceedingly rude to kill me. So I just need one more thing. Where is that last stone? You give me my stone. Oh! Managed to help someone in the process. I managed to help someone in the process of moving, moving rocks. 
Yahoo! Take my hand and we will restore the city. Um, I just want to check out what, what the, what, how many starites there are left. Um, shows me that there's still two more of the minor ones. Oh! So it was with the lobster and the mermaid. Blunder the sea. I've outgrown my old residence. There'll be a larger place to live. Hmm. Let's see, we gotta think sensibly about what sort of houses he could afford on and those mortgages. You know. Given mortgage rates today, uh, it's better than you might have been able to get, say, two decades ago. <laughs> that that works, I suppose. Give me some gizmo from the world, gizmo from the world above the sea. A foot. A piece from your world. <laughs> this oh, that looks like part of the foreground to me. So it, it's been catching me this whole time. Uh, help get help the goats pa get past the sea troll. Sea goats, sea trolls. Okay, I guess I'm I'm. Joseph, or whatever. The sea troll hungers for something remote. Feed it something that tastes like each goat. So that's a berry like aquatic goat, so let's give a berry. Chomp. Mm, the berry allowed this first ghost to pass. Now he grazes on luscious green grass. The second goat approaches, ready to eat. Feed the sea troll a supplementary treat. Salty, huh? Twice the ghosts were allowed to slip, slip by, now it's time for the last goat to try. The sea troll de desires a fiery flavor, give it something spicy to savor. So we need a pepper. The, I guess it is a vegetable. Explosion! The sea goat's gruff has been done. The goats are safe. So we still need to do one more star ride, one more main mission. Discover what drained the ocean. Hmm. Oh. The unsunken city, okay. Hmm, looks like we got our culprit. Just, we don't know it yet. That's the difference between player knowledge and character knowledge. Oh, I guess the characters do know this. The city has been drained by a league of mad scientists. Distract the scientists with a creature from legends. A Mathulu. Nuclear physicist is tired of studying uranium. Show her a new element to research. Plutonium! Mm -hmm. Ah! 
Was I green before that? I don't think I was. The roboticists cannot find any clean bedding for their robot hamster. Get the hamster cage some new bedding. What? Why do you need that for a robot hamster? The star ride is open for the taking. This seems too easy. Oh no! This is an imposter star ride, and the gate locked. The door only opens for mad scientists. Dress Maxwell up with two objects to fool the camera. So we need, um... Let's see. What's that thing that doctors wear on their heads? You know, it's kind of like a, a metal circle on a band that goes across the head. Yeah. Let's see. Doctors... Coat. Okay, doctoral coat. And then we need... I'll just go with glasses. No, wait. Goggles. Being a sad, mad scientist is also about what is on the inside. Apply an adjective to Maxwell to make him think like a mad scientist. Glowing mad. The disguise has fooled the gate. Now it is time to destroy the drain. The mad scientist was actually a robot self to self destruct. Uh, find a way to contain the blast. Uh, uh, that works. Up to the surface you go, where you arguably could do more damage. And that will conclude this episode of The Captain Plays Quibble Knots Unlimited. Thank you for watching.